and welcome back to my channel uh, today i have a quick video a comparison between these um, three uh, tiffany's fragrances tiffany's um, original perfume then tiffany's sheer and tiffany's intense so um, if you're interested then keep watching so as some of you know i already done a review of tiffany's intense this one here so you can watch it in my playlist and today we're going to compare all the three together so i'm going to spray them and then uh, compare and then um yeah let's see how it goes so first i've got a uh, sheer so this one is supposed to be um mandarin uh, black currant rose lang lang and musk and iris i've tried it before um a few months ago and uh, yeah let's see so I'm going to give you my first impressions. Oh wow, this is really, really nice. <laughs> yeah, definitely something interesting is appearing. It's very fresh and um, quite fruity, but woody at the same time. Yeah, it's very delicate and fresh. Okay, let's uh, give it a bit of time and now let's spray the original uh, first uh, Tiffany's perfume that came out. Let's spray it here. Okay, this one is more... Um, there is the um, bergamot, lemon, so more citrusy, more sharp and um yeah there's supposed to be iris and rose and fruits yes okay now the fruits are coming out as well okay okay let's give it uh, some time and then let's spray the last one which is the intense uh which we already know but let's compare all the two all the three together and then let's see so Okay, this one, <laughs> yes, I think it's going to be my favorite out of the three, but let's give them some time to develop. So obviously, if you haven't seen my previous um, video on the in uh, Tiffany's Intense on this one, then uh, yeah, it's um, it starts with pear and mandarin, uh, pink pepper, and then it has the obviously the famous powdery iris, um, rose and jasmine. And then it has a musk, benzoin, and amber, and it's obviously more woody, more intense. So this one is on this hand, and then um, the sheer and the original one, I have it here. Okay. So yeah, there are some very big differences between the three, and definitely the intense is the most powerful, the most woody. Uh, the most obviously intense and uh, it has the most uh, most of the iris but um, since we already know this one let's focus a little bit more on the first two so oh my god so the sheer is now developing really into something really really fresh yeah it's beautiful it's um, I would describe it as something well, I guess maybe it's all of them, they're, they're um, created to be worn maybe for a special day because a special day, I mean like the wedding day or engagement or something like that because obviously they all come with these uh, type of bottles that are um, diamond shape. This one comes in a clear bottle, this one comes in light green and this one is like the, this one, the most green um out of the three but yeah I, I really love sheer it's gorgeous it's so fresh oh yeah definitely <laughs> yeah definitely it's a, a bridal type of scent for sure yeah for a beautiful wedding with flowers and all that shebang this is this is the one and then the original Tiffany's, I don't know, I'm not 
that crazy about this one to be perfectly honest so out of the three i would say this one uh, is my favorite so the uh, intense version and then the sheer and then uh, tiffany's original one i'm not it doesn't really have anything original about it i wouldn't say it has you can smell the bergamot the lemon so it's more citrusy and mus musky and patchouli at the at the base but it's i can't really smell it much to be honest it's not it's not original so i'm a little bit disappointed with this one to be perfectly honest yeah it's definitely a much lighter version of the intense lighter and fresher so um yeah definitely this one is the most um fresh the most uh, fruity and refreshing and yeah it's very beautiful and uh, this one is um also fresh but more woody i would say and uh, this one the intense one obviously it's um it's more you can see a smell this iris really prominent and yeah and woodiness and iris basic powdery so um yeah these are my impressions of uh, these uh, fragrances and um i'll come back um soon and report back about the longevity so we already know that this one is very long lasting and it's um it lasts uh, on the skin um very long it maybe it's not like the biggest projecting type of pr fragrance but it it is long lasting but let me come back uh, in a minute well not in a minute but <laughs> in some time and report back about these how they are performing and uh, i'll speak to you in a minute so i'm back uh, with um the fragrances and um I can uh, say that I changed my mind about um, the original uh, Tiffany's because actually it is uh, very nice. It turns uh, very um, nice and um, musky and kind of woody. So actually it turns really beautiful. So I think it just needed a little bit more time to develop because it was bursting with some freshness uh, first and then it kind of turned weird but yeah it is nice and woody this one stays pretty much the same throughout the sheer and um, it uh, becomes a little bit less fresh and it uh, becomes more um, rosy and um, irisy <laughs> and then obviously this one is um, the intense it's very linear it's pretty much stays quite the same throughout the entire time and the longevity for those fragrances i would say it's pretty much the same so they are uh, very long lasting they um, don't change as much um, but uh, this one is the most unchanged and these they change a little bit from that original outburst of um, the freshness on the beginning and this one turns more rosy and this one turns more woody and this one obviously stays as irisy and powdery as ever so um yeah this is my review of all these um three uh, fragrances my comp comparison and um yeah i don't know out of the three which one is my favorite after a while <sighs> I don't know i think still sheer and the intense would be my two favorites and then i still like this one um it's a little bit more kind of spicy and just a little bit woody so um yeah sheer is absolutely gorgeous i love it and uh, the intense i love it as well so um yeah i hope it gives you some idea about these um three fragrances and um maybe it's easier to choose but yeah definitely wouldn't mind getting the full bottle of uh, the sheer 
and obviously you still have loads of the intense one so um yeah that would be it for now uh, if you liked it give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you very soon bye